Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Earthbound. As you can see, we're exactly where we left off. So we're gonna go down here. Pretty sure this guy's a Ah Oh he's not screaming, he's yawning. If I yawn like this, it looks like I'm growing off. Uh, yes it does. Okay then. Uh I'm here, it's landed, the sharks are running wild in town, you're stupid because you say the same thing, and it's just another case of NPC syndrome. Don't you know what time it is? Get your butt home pronto! I can't remember if I talked to him before or not. This guy still says the same thing, he's still saying he can go off in the mountain this way. Stupid. And while walking to the same place. I wonder if these guys are home. Let's see. Are they? Oh, still picky. They have a cactus. That's strange. Why do they have a cactus? Uh, I guess. Why does anyone have a cactus? Just a people down there, still blocked off. Welcome home, Ness. It's not necessary to talk about it tonight. It's late. Let's go up to bed now. No, I don't wanna. Oh, Ness, you don't understand the importance of a good night's sleep. And she says nothing. No problem here. No problem here. Welcome home, Ness. It's blah 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 blah. Yes, I want to go to bed. Forgot to start. Okay, so later that night, there was steak, and we went to bed. And now there's knocking at the door. We're in our pajamas again with our messed up hair. We got the table, and we went through this, and that's creepy knocking with creepy music. And you're up again. What do you say? Some knocking at the door. What an annoying knock. Okay then. We know now who's annoying. Well, let's see. Who have we met yet so far that's annoying? Pretty much everyone in the game so far. No, not really. You, my land! Who could be knocking at the door at this time of night? Would you answer it? You're going to make me answer it. Oh, yeah, also, just a fact if you go down into this corner over here, she can actually trap you. You have to do a bunch of fancy maneuvers to get out, I'm pretty sure, but I'm not going to test that because that'd be stupid. It'd be like walking into a pitfall that you knew was there. I've got fleas sucking up me dry. So I'm just going to lay still for... Ugh, uh, uh, why is that stupid? Okay, so, gonna... Okay, just let yourself in. Why did you do that before? We got the bad music. No, we got odd music. Hey, this is, this is just what I got to say. Why is it taking you to the place where the mirror landed? Oh, good evening, ma'am. You're looking lovely as usual. <laughs> anyway, as I was saying, the police that were guarding the meteorite landing left suddenly to deal with the sharks. And you know the sharks, they're local reference. See, I told you it makes sense later to all those who believe that they were actually shark, might be sharks, like going on land. I totally didn't. Just no. <laughs> Totally not. Anyway, suddenly I noticed that Picky was gone. I blame the cops. You blame everyone, except yourself. That's why you're dumb. It certainly wasn't my fault at all. Of course it wasn't. When my dad gets back, I know I'm gonna get it. You're my bestest friend. You wanna want you help me find Picky? Uncle Pokey wants you to help find Picky. I'm not gonna answer the call. If you excuse me, I'll say something that'll cut you like a knife. You come with me? No. Okay, okay, I won't say anything to hurt you. Will you please come with me? No. If you're using the outfit, okay, just keep repeating the same thing over and over again. So, more NPC syndrome. Okay, good buddy. Let's blow this popsicle sand. They had a thing going there for a bit. Before you go, why don't you say goodbye to your mom? Don't you agree, ma'am? Not sure why I was going for that, but okay. I know that dog is unreliable, but you should take King along. I crack bad in Tracy's room. I already got this. No matter what to say, you're a courageous, strong boy. My very own natural born fighter. I'm like 10. You'll go far. Remember, go for it. But I think you should change out of your jammies before you leave. I don't wanna. I wanna beat stuff in my pajamas. I can punch some dogs or fleas or fish. Fish sounds good. Maybe some cows. Then I had more steak. Yay, steak! Okay. Is Tracy in here? No, she is not. And I didn't need to check that corner because I already know. Because this is actually my second time going through this recording because my mic is stupid. Anyway, I'll do anything I can to help you. Good luck on your venture. You might get a lot. You might get hungry along the way. So here's a cookie. Let's got the cookie. You can also leave anything you don't need with me. So do you want me to hang on to something? Well, let's see what we can store. 
Let's store our weapon! No. <laughs> Do you need anything else for me? Nope. I'm not storing any of your stuff. Do you need anything else? Uh, no. Oh, you have to rest back. Well, take care. I'll talk to you later. Yeah, sure. You're cool. Whatever. Yeah, isn't she a nice mom? I mean, she let us go out at night when there's sirens, and there could be danger, it could be a robbery. And there was a big explosion, she's like, yeah, you can go. And now she's like, ah, you're cool, whatever. Just, just go. Go away. I don't want you out. Anyway. Oh, right, you go in front and I'll follow at a safe distance for like 50 yards. Let's get going. Or if he could actually join the party. Fine, take him. Do you want me to go with you? Um, if you say no, he's like, Oh, you just want to talk to me, because I'm so adorable. No, you're not. I'm just going to take you now. So there we go, and we're about to set out on our epic journey. Ready, the go! Go! And we're interrupted. What happens if we try to leave? The phone is ringing. Answer it! At my house, my dad gets bent if I don't get the phone. Wow. Within the first three rings. Wow, I did not think Ness actually had dialogue. Huh. That's a little hidden thing, I guess. Hello, it's your dad. Work to exhaustion when you're young. Have you ever heard of a weird saying like this? No. Just remember, I'm always behind you 100%. Don't be afraid. I'm not afraid. I can beat up anything. I got a bat. I know that you're brave. You can do it. Don't forget to call me periodically during your adventure. I don't want to. I can make a record of your progress when you call me. Oh yeah, I deposited 30 bucks in your bank account. Ooh, he's got money. Do you have your ATM card? Withdraw your money from any cash machine and buy whatever you need. Good luck, my boy. I feel like such a hero. What? Well, the father of you, at least. Wahahaha! <laughs> Slam! Beep! I don't know what that was. I was trying to... something. I do not know. Well, Tracy's gone. So now we can leave. Finally! We're out of the house, and it's still night. Can we go down here now? Yes! Oh! Hey, Ness! So are you just gonna wander around wherever you please? Don't you think we should focus on getting Vicky home so you can get out of trouble? Fine. Jerk. Don't wanna go exploring. Just going after your stupid but Ah! Did not see him there. He kinda blended in, I guess. So, we got an enemy. Last time, I mean, the last recording I did, it was a dog, now it's a snake. So, we got the snake. Not really anything really too important. King, he attacks, but you'll see that Pokey does nothing. They're they're not seen at the bottom where that is because well, they're not permanent. They'll be leaving. Quite shortly. Uh and I guess I better explain this battle menu for those who haven't ever seen anything like this. Hello, if you've never seen anything like this, why are you watching this? Anyway, bash is attack, goods are items, PSI is like magic or whatever, we don't have any right now. It uses PP, a set amount of PP, like different ones use different ones, I don't know. Defend increases your defense for a turn, or perhaps the damage or something like that. Uh, auto fight is auto fight, it does a turn on its own, and I don't recommend that. Or does it do a turn on its own? Might as well find this out now. And run away is run away. Can you growl and lunge forward? Oh, it just... Ooh, we got a smash. That's this game's version of crits. That means King just got a crit. Hmm. We might gain one XP. Those things are pointless. Almost. Almost pointless. Because... Pretty soon... I believe... Half... Let's see here, what we got? Uh, oh yeah, another thing you can do, you can make an enemy go off screen, and it has a chance of either disappearing or spawning a new enemy. See? Look, now it's a dog. So now we can go over this guy. Also does nothing! <laughs> Except growl at you every now and then. Use spiking attack. E. 6 HP, that's kinda ill. Smile sincerely. Yeah, Pokey, you just keep doing nothing. You're so useful. I love you so much. Not really. Bash. A lot of piercing. How do you think that would do something like scare you? Apologize profoundly. And there we go. Dead. Gain 4 XP and... Oh, what's this? Our first level up. Well, what would an RPG be without leveling up, eh? Offense went up by one, that does, that's obvious what it does. You fail life, you don't know what offense does. I mean, seriously, it's in the name. It raises your attack, by the way. Maximum HP, again, 
just raises your HP. Maximum PP also raises your PP, which is down there where it says PP. Not sure why I had to point it out. Next relay is the power of Life Up Alpha. That is a healing move. And we did not gain any other stats. Go over the other stats later. When we actually get some. Ugh, sorry. Excuse me about that. Now, not meaning any... Oh, oh, now we got the... Is he ready? It, what? Oh, uh, why did I do that? Yeah, that's a back attack when it goes green. And it makes him go first, and he wasted his turn. Anyway, you'll notice that the pose looks kind of strange. I think in the Japanese version, they actually had a cigarette. Anyway, I'm gonna kill this fight with Crow. 9 HP. Oh, he complained at me. What did I do? Tried to do something and failed. Wow. Oh, confusely, and Spiteful Crow is down. We killed it. Killed it dead. This game 3 XP. The enemy left a present. Inside the present was a cookie. And they will drop lots of cookies. I think it's like 50%, if not that, 100. Well, if we fight it. What the heck just happened? Oh, you jerk. Well, be right back. Looks like I'm gonna have to go into editing magic here. Okay, sorry about that. Apparently, game froze, but I'm back to where we were before, and I've I've gained a few more cookies, but that's it. No more levels. Anyway, so yeah, not sure why that happened. That didn't happen my entire playthrough last time. It's the only time it'll happen. Okay, so. He's complaining at me again. Oh, wow, I'm weak. Uh, use, use a cookie. Okay, we won. Gain one XP. Now, do 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 do. Go over here. That's the present we already got. Now, gonna go, there's a crow down there. Uh, what do you say? Hey, Ness. I was too busy to investigate. I heard a child's voice on the hilltop. I'm a busy man. A job and do it well. A man's man. You did a job well, but I don't know. What are you even doing? Eh, we might find out later. Anyway, so it looks like Picky's crying. So maybe we should go there and comfort him. Or I will probably end up having to do that. It's bad because I don't know. Anyway, what's this? Oof! <laughs> I knew this was going to be such a scary. Oh yeah, only people who can use PSI can understand animals, to my understanding. And of course the player. But as far as I know, if someone if it shows something in brackets, only you can understand it. Or someone else who uses PSI. I won't have to come along. I'm out of here. And then Pokey's probably like, Your dog's a stupid, he ran off. Anyway. So caution, there's still lots of fires burning here and there. It's hot. It's hot. Anyway, crying? Nope. Whoa! Oh, whoa! You woke me up! Pokey! I've been looking all over you! Oh, he's... He was asleep. You see, Pokey got scared and ran away. Well, that sounds like him. I think I'm gonna trust you, Mr. Picky Guy. Well, I'm glad that you're okay, at least. Let's go home. I bet Mom and Dad are worried sick about us. Geez, sometimes I wonder which one of us is the real big brother. Okay, so we got Picky to join. Ness, do you hear a buzzing sound? If you say no, he's like, what? Are you sure you don't hear it? Come on! Anyway. But I'm going to say yes, because I don't feel like going through that. Anyway, he's like, Arr. Anyway, so yes, we do hear it. It just does this scene anyway. Whether you say yes or no, so I don't think you can go with by saying no. You just get a little bit of extra dialogue from Pokey. Also, I realize now that when we were trying to leave, that anyway, let's see how fast we can do this. A BIM, not. I'm from 10 years in the future. And, in the future, all the station. I guess, Universal Cosmic Destroyer. Is that all? Eternal Darkness. However, you must listen. Where I'm from, there is well, no, 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 when is when it reaches the point, he will find light. At the same time, we'll shatter the night we rock, and we will reveal the path of light. You see, in my opinion, that you are that boy, Ness. That's what I believe. Dot dot dot. I guess this monstrous plan must have been set in motion somewhere on the earth. If you want to start to confront the enemy immediately, you might have time to counter the evil. Three things are important: wisdom, courage, friendship. Legends of uh, three boys and girl. If you can guess, we're running out of time. I will tell you more later. Go now and do not be anxious about the future. You have much to do, yes? Do you listen to what I said? Yes. This was an story, blah blah blah. And. He joins you. 
Buzz Buzz now joins you. So we have Buzz Buzz, and now we're gonna shut up Pokey. Okay, come on, Lanlet. Gonna have to go now. So shut up, Pokey. He's just saying, oh, I'm not the guy, am I? No, I'm not. Anyway, that's our game. Okay, uh, uh yeah, now, bye. So, bye. See you next time.